to the board would be uh, that we uh, honor the request for a one-year extension and that we uh, do a revision to the economic development agreement and we reduce the number of jobs from required from 40 down to 30 and that we reflect the capital investment, the increase in the capital investment from $8 million uh, to add that additional $1,480,950. Mr. Guthrie, do we need to fluctuate that? The, the agreement expires March 1st, 2011. We extended that until 2012. We would be extending it again 2013, but incorporating the capital investment additive to the economic development. I recommend also. Yeah, we've got a recommendation from staff and our attorney to revise the economic development agreement as it relates to state a decrease in the job requirement um, and reflect the increase in capital investment. Any further discussion or questions on this? Um, Mr. Orlando, in reviewing this whole situation, um, I think it's notable that you committed more of your company to Valdosta during this period of time meaning the headquarters here yes and for whatever reason you know you're here and um, that shows your commitment to our community absolutely and um, that's awesome you know I'm very proud for that I'm proud for you and um, I think it's just right that we show our commitment to you and you've exceeded your capital investment requirement but um, I think that's that's good news and helps us justify modifying the, the amendment or amending the, the agreement and uh, I'd like to make the motion that we accept it as presented Motion. Let, let me ask a question for the discussion. We'll hold the motion. Okay. Do you see in the future that you have enough ground where you are? Do we yeah. need to be thinking of that? Uh, uh, yes. Presently, yes. We we propose, and the reason for this extension, as I was explaining to Alan, is in a year because we see a trend changing. We we finally have the stability, you know, with the company, and it's starting to move in an upward demand, we want to start the test track next year and we feel more comfortable with everything released back to us so we can make the capital investment in the test track. We do have an area in the current site where we're going to build another a paint facility possibly of 10,000 square feet plus there's an additional six acres on the other side of the property line so we're in pretty good pretty good uh, standing right now and thank you very much for asking I do appreciate that but that's that's our vision and we already have plans you know what we're going to do because of the economic uh, condition is next year about this time is we want to start we're going to build the test track in sections okay we're going to do first the skid pad and ex acceleration deceleration and then also I have connections with the Atlanta Bureau FBI that they're, we're going to possibly once it's completed probably in two years I'm a realist we, we will be doing accident and simulated driving training for different agencies throughout uh, Georgia with Thank the track. You. Thank you. Mm -hmm. um, we have a motion, may I get a second? Second. We have a motion second with regard to the revision of the economic development agreement for STEDA. All in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposition? None. Ma'am. 